Hi there, it's JP speaking, your grilling instructor. Today it's about cooking a pork belly, or panceta, as we call it, in our barbecue 01SS. First, we are going to let it brine overnight. This brine is a solution of 5% salt in water by weight, with some star anise, black peppercorn and cloves. Once it's brine, we can start prepping it for the grill. Score the leather with a sharp knife and set aside while making the marinade. Today's marinade contains paprika, grounded black pepper, chili flakes, coarse salt, turmeric powder, onion powder, cumin powder, roast garlic and olive oil. Just remember that you can use any spices of your liking. Feel free to play with the flavors that you want to experience in your food. Crush it all together until you get a fluid paste. Gently rub it all over the pork belly. Try to get the spice mix in every corner of it. Now it's time to get this baby on the grill. Hit the firewood to make the embers fall. And place them evenly under the piece of meat. Remember, the bricks underneath will help you transfer the heat evenly. Check out the temperature placing your hand carefully, one or one and a half inches above the grill. You should be able to count until 10 without feeling the urge of taking out the hand. If it's too hot, lift it up with the handle. And if it's lacking some heat, just lower the grill as close to the embers as needed. Close the lid to create an open effect. Always be aware of your brazier. You should never run out of embers, so keep in mind to add some firewood. Because we always like to go the extra mile, we want to add some smoky flavor to this beauty. Soak some wood chips in water, so they burn slowly and don't catch fire, and place them over the embers. Let's check how the pork belly is coming. Whoa, look at that! That's almost chicharron right there. After a total of 4 to 5 hours of slowly cooking, this is the result. A juicy, mouth-watering, outstanding piece of panceta. Ready to enjoy with good wine and good friends. 
that's the tag good way. <laughs>